Hey guys, I'm back. I'm trying to hurry up so my resin doesn't set up. So, these have all been cleaned with alcohol. And it is starting to set up, I think. So, I don't know how this is going to work out. We'll just move on to the next. And I'm just going to do a puddle pour and blow it out. Because I don't have a lot of time before it all goes wacko. Oops, this one's crooked. Well, I learned something today. Make sure you have all your stuff plugged in. Your husband has not taken your extension cord. And um, work very, very fast. So I'll throw some acetone in these cups here and hopefully it'll keep it from completely ruining my cups. Uh, it looks like bubble gum. Oops, too much, too much, too much. It's coming out in huge globs because it's getting hard. So I'm still gonna try to make it work. If you don't see this video, it means it didn't work. Yeah, it's coming out in huge, ugly globs. Oops, and that one keeps moving. So this stuff's expensive too. I don't like wasting it. Let's get the red on there real quick and heat it up. Heaty, heaty, heaty. I'm just gonna move from one to the next. I know it's gonna leave a trail. A big trail. Woo! Here we go. Bubble gum. I'm bummed. I am very bummed. So if worse comes to worse, I'll get a sander sander and sand these down and redo them. Yeah, this set up pretty quickly. All right, here we go. Whew. So, I find that acetone actually helps out with all my um, cleaning my resin stuff. That's what I've been using the last few days, and it has worked out really well. All right, let's try this. See what happens, see what happens. Yep, it's too hard. It's setting up too much. I got crap everywhere.
I'm having to get really close to push this around because it's feeling so quickly. And it's setting up. They covered. I don't believe it. So these are just some tiles I had that I wanted to try practicing stuff on. And today was definitely a practice. So although I didn't know what I was looking for, I still kind of like it. They're kind of cool. The color spread around nicely. I mean, it took some work. Worked up a sweat. But I got everything covered and um, they actually look kind of cool. So the takeaway here is make sure you have everything you need before you start. And um, work quickly. Where are my tweezers? You know, things like tweezers and such stuff because I have some chingus in here that I need to get out and my tweezers seem to have wandered away as well. So I think this is paint that, yep, it's a chunk of paint. Ah. Glad this stuff self levels. Okay, well that's it. I don't know if that's the tile I uncovered or let's do this. And heat it up again. See what? Oh, yep, that's not gonna work. I messed it up. This might just be a set of three tiles, or of three uh, coasters. Again, they'll probably stay at my house. Oh, that actually works. 
All right, guys. That is it for the day. I got to go clean up. We got family coming over for dinner. But I wanted to get something in before, um, before the day was out. So those are my red, white, and blue pours. Let's go over and look at the other one since it's been sitting there for a few minutes. So this is the one I just did. That actually came out really cool for someone who doesn't know what the heck they're doing. I don't have a lot of pink in there. I do like this lacing right here. That is really pretty. That's the only lacing, but hey. I'm going to have to get me a uh, spray bottle for some alcohol. That's almost trying to lace, but I think it's done. And then what was left of the clear, I put on this one. So I like the way that's coming out. I think this actually has a lot of depth. I think I like resin pouring it with the exception that I have to work so fast. And then we have these little guys over here. So they're actually setting up nicely with all the work I had to do. I think that's probably my favorite one. I like the center of it. And let's see. Yeah, that one's okay. That's mostly blue. But yeah, I think they came out okay for somebody who doesn't uh, know what they're doing. All right, thank you guys for watching. God bless. Pray for each other. And happy 4th of July. Thank you to all our veterans. Um, most of my family has been military, so I have an affinity for the military. So you guys take care. Bye.